Ladies and gentlemen, what we're going to do is we're going to get into, um, we're going to do, a, we're going to start with our partial sum. All right. So any time that we have a finite term, we're going to be dealing with partial sums. All right. Um, so now let's just go ahead and use this. So we know that i is equal to 1. So therefore, we're going to do 3 over 10 to the first plus 3 over 10 to the squared plus 3 over 10 cubed. Well, we know this is going to be 3 over 10 plus 3 over 100 plus 3 over 1,000. All right. Now, let's just go and take a little, let's go and convert these over to a decimal form to kind of make a little bit more sense of them. So decimal form of this is just going to be, we could say I was on our 0.3. Then we could play, say this is going to be plus 0 0.03 plus 0 0.003. So therefore, our solution is going to be 0.333. OK? Make sense? So it's just a partial sum? That's just the partial. Anytime we're going to have our finite, we're going to have a number that's going to be finite, we're going to be dealing with a partial sum. So if ever I'm asking, that means the number. We're done. We're done after 3, right? We don't add any more after 3. OK? So we're done. It's not infinite. So it's <laughs> partial sum. So what we, everything I've done so far have all been partial sums, all right? Because we're ending at a value, OK? Now, here's where it's going to get fun. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's say I.